Hi guys, so we're gonna get spring roll, spring onions because this is what we're gonna use for the toppings and since this is the only thing that we have so far in our garden, this is the only thing that we're gonna harvest. <laughs> so this is onions, they need to get trimmed too. I don't feel bad. You're always getting closer to How long did it take you to yield this kind of harvest? It's not even typically harvest. It's just, it's it's just the thing. It's so you're saying you need how much time to um, grow? This is like a month of spring onions. You think this is good for us? Huh? I think that is more than enough. We don't want to eat the whole garden in one day. <laughs> to make a ramen on the fly a ramen that you can make fast so I'm going to start with the broth because we are going to make everything from scratch so the, the first things first the things that we need is these are the ingredients so we're gonna start with the broth Oops, it's very, it's <laughs> so, the broth is going to consist of red miso, you can see it's organic red miso, onions, just like this kind of onion, I'm just going to chop this onion, that's it, and I'm going to put it in the broth, and I'm going to use ginger, chopped ginger or um, grated ginger is the best. And for the toppings, we are going to use fried bean curd, which is you can get this from your local Asian store. Mushrooms, which is this um, shiitake mushrooms. We are gonna go. We are going to toss some of it inside too. And we are going to use rice ramen, organic jade pearl rice ramen, which is coming from a pack. And we are going to use this one because we don't have pasta maker yet. And this is easier. This is easier. This is like 30 minute meal. Boom. And flavor profiles. Okay, we have the egg. The marinated egg. I marinated this egg in one part soy sauce, one part water, and then a splash of Japanese vinegar, which is mirin. And we have chili paste. I have homemade, but we're going to try do using this one. We're going to use sesame chili oil, kikuman, Japanese soy sauce, and the spring onions that we got from the garden. I think that's it. That's it for now. So we're going to start building the broth. Um, an improvised container. And then this is, we're going to grate the ginger. We like ginger. We love ginger. And this ginger is very good for your immune system. First ingredient in the broth is inside. We are going to make... We are going to toss some onions. So what I like to do with the onions is just... I'm just, I'm just gonna like roughly chop this or...
So this goes to the broth too. Everything just goes into the broth. A little bit, and I'm gonna put the. I'm gonna put a little bit of soy sauce just to put a little bit of saltiness in the broth. Some chili oil, sesame chili oil. You know what I'm saying? Maybe just a teaspoon. That's, that's a lot, right? It's, I think that, uh, for two, one spoonful should be good. Like this? Yeah, for both of us. Yeah, I know it's really spicy. I made this and I know it's spicy. We're going to make our topping. So our broth, we're just going to leave the broth cooking for 30 minutes. Actually, I forgot one more thing. We need to put the miso. I love miso. Who loves miso in Japanese stores? We're gonna split it in two. And this one's we're just gonna cook this like a little bit in the broth. Like a little bit, so just two days or three days. Right? Two days, three days. Three. Days. This is so easy to make, guys. For real. Perfect. So I cooked the egg for like seven minutes. This is like the boiling time should be seven minutes, and it's very cute, crucial. You have to. Put the eggs in ice bath after you boil them. That's the toppings, guys. With the noodles now, we are officially done with the broth. And look at that. Good, good broth. Look at that. I'm so ready to eat. This is so enticing. I wish you could eat it on the screen. Oh. So this is our broth flavor profile and we're just gonna have a recap. On our toppings, this is our eggs. Shiitake mushrooms chopped and um, spring onions from our garden. Close to eating, guys. I'm just checking my noodles. I feel like I need more noodles than this. A little bit more. Our broth is smelling good, guys. It's very gingery, but it's fire. Cook this immediately. She's getting real. <laughs> she is real. Coronavirus. This shit is real. <laughs> okay, guys, we are officially done. I'm making this bowl for me. Actually, I'm just gonna strain it so I can get everything. A little bit of oil. Do a close up. And we are going to arrange it. So 
So two eggs each. Since we love. I like it, it's overflowing. So put in a little bit of broth first. <clears throat> you can like top it off the mushrooms so it's gonna be like, you know, it's gonna cook some of it. Since we didn't cook it, it's gonna kill some of the bacteria that could be there. But overall, fresh is fire! Oh. Mm -hmm. 